up cowboy fans out there this is will again coming at y'all with another video hey guys uh man it's almost friday dog i love thursday especially you know what it is friday right now y'all might say oh man it's thursday what you talking about no for me it's friday god damn it when you get the when you get the thursday's work day out of the way it's friday you know what i'm saying tgif like my mom used to always say but anyway guys i wanted to talk about Taco Charlton. I'm going to try to be real brief, uh, not to run my mouth and hold y'all too long, but I want to talk about my boy Taco Charlton. And, uh, uh, man, this guy, uh, th he's a good kid. I, I, I still have plenty of faith in this guy. I haven't really lost, despite the Hall of Fame game and what he's been going through in practice. But uh, I, I think this kid is a, has all the potential of the work in the world to be a good defensive end, if if done right, if taught right. But you have to be patient with a guy like this. Now, uh, I read this morning uh, when I had a little time on my hands. I read this morning that uh, they pulled Taco aside and uh, he went to the end zone with the strength and conditioning coach. You know, they started working on his footwork and his conditioning and kind of his technique trying to get that down he just kind of pulled they just kind of pulled him away from the other lineman uh so he can get off by himself and uh not really be distracted um that could be that could either be a good thing or a bad thing um now that reminds me and i'm gonna take y'all back right here that, that reminds me of uh back in the day when um you know certain kids in in your classroom needed tutoring and you know maybe they would probably go afterwards or they would go in between classes or uh, a teacher would come another teacher would come and get them you know out of the class while y'all were you know doing your work and things like that uh, just to kind of work on some strengths and weaknesses and you know a lot of kids learn faster than the other than others uh, and I'm learning that with you know with my my son he's in school now he's at, he'll be he'll be going to second grade uh, he'll be turning eight in September and uh, you know he's kind of like in the middle you know he's not just a super quick learner but he's not really slow either he's just kind of you know right average you get what I'm saying but uh, back to taco uh, it kind of reminds me of that you know them, them pulling him aside and, you know working on his footwork and trying to find his strengths and his weaknesses if he has any and make them better you get what I'm saying so uh, that that that's a positive thing about it, you know. Uh, it, it's not really. It sounds bad, but it's not really that bad. But uh, you know, that's what they're doing, and uh, you know, the, all, all the other linemen they were, you know, doing the basic drills and you know, full pads and contact drills, one-on-one -on -one drills, and tackling dummies and etc. So you know, it was kind of a normal practice with them while, while he was, you know, all the way in the end zone and doing his own thing. So it, it just kind of reminded me of that. But uh, like I say, I, I think this kid still still has all the potential in the world. I believe they should have let him have more reps in the uh, Hall of Fame game uh, instead of just two series. I mean, like I said in my videos before, the only way to learn and get better is to learn and get better, is to push him out there. The only way you're going to swim is to push him in the water. You're not going to swim running around the bank of the pool. You, you got to swim. You got to get in the water to swim. Now, if they keep alternating and keep babysitting them and, you know, stuff like that, it's going to hurt him. You know, that's just my opinion. I don't know about y'all. But, uh, you know, I, I, I'm a hands-on kind of guy, and I think they should just put him in the water. Just throw him out there, man, and uh, let him do his thing. And, uh, you know, it, it's cool that they pulling him to the side and, and, and working with him. But, you know, he's a grown man now. He's not a kid. He's not a college kid anymore where, you know, but maybe his ability is is allowing them to have to do that. So uh, I, I don't know. I don't want this kid to be a bust. I, I'm not saying he's going to be a bust, but you know I, I don't want him to be one. You know I want him to be because you, know, you got to remember, guys, we were a pass rush away from the Super Bowl last year. A pass rush away. A pa I've been saying that ever since last year, ever since we lost the game last year against Green Bay in the divisional round. We were pass rush away. If we had a pass rush guy, somebody get in there and uh, get nasty, and like, like Lawrence Taylor or somebody, we would have won that game probably. But, you know, it is what it is. You know, we lost, and that's just the bottom line. But uh, 
we, we, we were looking for a pass rusher. We drafted Taco for pass rusher. And you probably say, oh, you're panicking. Well, I'm not really panicking, but this is what we got this guy for. You get what I'm saying? So, and if he can't do the job, somebody else can. I'm not saying he can't do the job, but if he can't do the job, somebody else will. You get what I'm saying? So, I, I just really hope he grows up really fast and uh, he gets with it because I... I, I you know, looking at his Michigan highlights, man, he was a beast. I mean, this guy was unstoppable. He was, he was, he was purely unblockable. Uh, he, he looked like a, 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 a man amongst the boys. You know, he looked like NFL bound right there, right then. So, but uh, you know, I just wanted to run my mouth about Taco, man. I don't really have too much. I'm not getting into stats for help because he doesn't have any yet. So, uh, <laughs> if, that, if that's what y'all looking for, y'all wait till the season starts for that. But, uh, uh, you know, tell me what y'all think in the comments about this guy, man. I know everybody's been probably making videos about him, but I just wanted to voice my opinion, you know, because the, the media and the, the news, everybody's been hard on him, you know, even myself. I, you know, I, 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 uh, I admit, you know, I've been, you know, like, come on, Taco, you know, not really hard, but just, you know, want him to do better, you know, so, but, uh, you know, y'all let me know what you think in the comments. Leave a like, subscribe. Um, let me know what you think. And, uh, you know, holler back at me, man. I'm out. And the only thing else I got to say is...